Daytona Beach, Florida, home to Hangster's Hot Rods Muscle Car and Collector Car Showroom, where we own all of our vehicles. We are not a consignment dealership. If you're watching today's presentation on YouTube, please be sure to check out our website, hangsters.com. There is where you can find all of our most current inventory. Our YouTube videos, we never take down. We leave them up at all times. We use the same channel for both our PA location as well as our store here in Daytona Beach. However, when a vehicle is funded in full, that particular unit comes down off of our website, dropping into the sold category, letting you know it's no longer available for sale. Hangstersgarage.com. Check that website out as well. Not only do we sell and distribute automotive parts and accessories across the United States, but more importantly, we install them. So if you're watching one of our video presentations, you want a different wheel and tire package, AC, uh, power disc brakes, power steering, uh, upgraded dash package, maybe some LED, maybe digital. Uh, we can do all that for you prior to your vehicle leaving. Hangstersgarage.com, check it out. <clears throat> so in our years of doing this, we move a lot of vehicles through our showroom, not only here in Daytona, but also in Pennsylvania. And um, you get to buy and sell a lot of very unique vehicles and you get to see and drive a lot of cool cars. <clears throat> and some of them that you sell really stick in your mind and this car is going to be one of those vehicles. Today we're going to present to you a 1968 Ford LTD. It's the original miles, has a Marty report, the car is heavily documented. Um, it's a very unique car, a car that's going to sell very fast. Um, so I'm, I'm very pleased to be able to present this vehicle to you. So let's check it out. 428, uh, it is the original motor. Uh, the big booster there that's mounted to the uh, driver's side firewall, that is your power brake booster. The car does have power brakes. No power steering and no AC. The car is the original color. It is by certainly not the original paint, but uh, definitely the original color. I told you the car is heavily documented. We will show you that here uh, shortly. The uh, documentation is in the trunk. The paint on this car is absolutely fantastic. Let's look at the hood first of all. Uh, the color is nice and uniform. The clear is nice and uniform. Uh, it's probably one of the, uh, we have 70 cars in our building right now and this is probably one of the nicest paint jobs in the building. Uh, really, really nice paint on the car, uh, both high and low. Top of the fenders, top of the hood, really, really nice. Does have the hideaway headlights. Uh, chrome on the front bumper is in really nice condition. Um, it, no rust around the bumper bolts, no flaking of the chrome, no peeling of the chrome, no rust pits anywhere. So super nice car up front and up top on the hood and the fenders. As we go around to the uh, driver's side of the car, uh, you're going to notice a couple things. Uh, first of all, it does have aftermarket five-star American racing wheels, raised white letter BFG tires. Take a look at the wheels and tires closely on the website. 428 badge on the driver's side front fender. Let's look at uh, the fender closely. It, the paint on the car is fantastic, once again. Very expensive paint job. Uh, I'm not sure, I didn't thumb through every last piece of uh, documentation. I don't think we have any documentation on when the car was painted, but nonetheless, it wasn't a cheap paint job. Does have a really nice white pinstripe that runs along the uh, center body line of the vehicle. Starts out on the fender, continues down the door, and onto that huge rear quarter of our 68 LTD. Front windshield, <clears throat> glass clarity, uh, not only on the front windshield, but all around the car is absolutely fantastic. Um, super nice uh, front windshield, nice chrome that encompasses uh, the front windshield. Uh, this car is just stellar. Uh, let's take a look at the window glass on the uh, driver's side. Vent window, driver door, rear quarter glass, all real nice and clear. Uh, your chrome around your vent window is nice. Uh, chrome on the mirrors are fantastic. One on the uh, driver's side door, one on the passenger side door. <clears throat> Vinyl top, let's take a look at that while we're here. Um, see up top here above the front windshield where there could be problems on older cars. Uh, it's real nice, no uh, rust bubbles or anything going on under the convert or under, under the vinyl top, not the convertible top. Uh, same thing behind the uh, drip rail molding, no issues there. 
Uh, drip rail molding looks to be pretty nice all around the driver door glass and then around the quarter window. <clears throat> Chrome on the uh, door handle in real nice shape. Body lines on the car are fantastic. Uh, it's an original mile car, 4,000 and some change. We're going to show you that here uh, throughout the presentation as well. But uh, body lines on the car are, are amazing. Uh, rear quarter, driver door, front fender, everything's fantastic. <clears throat> Let's look inside the car. Um, so vinyl on the door panel, uh, great, great shape. Uh, vinyl, armrest, uh, wood grain, LTD, crank window for your vent, crank window for your uh, door glass. Four speed car, bench seat four speed. Obviously blue interior. Um, <clears throat> take a look in the back seat. Look at the lights in the sail panels. The lights in the sail panels illuminate when I open the driver door. Uh, back seats in fantastic condition. Nice big heavy rubber floor mats in the car. Uh, carpeting underneath the floor mats in fantastic shape. Look at that steering wheel in fantastic condition. The, I'm going to show you in the test drive, I mean, I'll show you real quickly here while we're outside the car, but the clarity of that instrument panel, you know, from the wood grain to the, uh, you know, the glass on the speedometer to the radio, I mean, everything is fantastic condition. Look at the chrome on the pedals. Front uh, carpeting on the driver's side. This car is Awesome. Um, bench seat, everything's in good shape from the uh, cushion to the uh, material. You know, we have cloth in the center here uh, and then vinyl on the outskirts. Uh, headliners in fantastic shape. <clears throat> the courtesy lights illuminate in the floor, uh, both on the driver and passenger side when you open up the door. <clears throat> awesome car. LTD badge there on the driver's side of the uh, drop down from the roof to the rear quarter. And then look at look at the chrome around the uh, vinyl top. And then look at the vinyl top itself, how there's no uh, bubbling or blistering under the vinyl top. <clears throat> Same thing here in the rear, all good. Look at it, again, look at the glass clarity. Your hat rack, speaker rack back there, everything is in real nice shape. Of course, your fuel door here on the driver's side. Antenna, pinstriping. <clears throat> Shot down the side of the car to show you that stellar body line. Real, real nice down the driver's side. Of course, with those large rear quarters comes a nice big uh, deck lid. So we're going to go real slow here and show you the top of the deck lid, the paint, how nice the paint is on the uh, deck lid on the top of the rear quarters. LTD in the center of the deck lid along with the Ford badging on the driver or passenger side of the deck lid as well. Chrome on the rear bumpers, uh, real nice also, just like it was in the uh, front. Let's pop that trunk, take a look. It's a nice deep, nice big trunk. So let's take a look at some of the stuff you might find on our website. Well, first of all, you got a spare up here. Uh, Marty Report, 1968 plant it was built at, motor it came with, LTD two-door hardtop, Brittany blue paint, uh, blue cloth, vinyl bench seat, scheduled for delivery May 9th, 1968 to the Cleveland District Sales Office. Uh, retail was uh, Bob Gillingham Ford in Parma, Ohio. Here is the original uh, sales receipt to uh, Ronald Hayes in Cleveland, May 28, 1968, Bob Gillingham Ford. Uh, build sheet. Uh, shop manual, don't see those anymore, everything's computerized. 
so, and there's also like a little book that just says, you know, 1968 Ford LTD, 428, 340 horsepower, four speed, 3,500 original miles. There's more on it now. One of 17 built. The car's been featured in Hemmings uh, magazine. Uh, so this uh, little binder will come with the car as well. Just another copy of the Marty Report, which you already have. Another copy of the sales receipt, which you already have. Another copy of the uh, build sheet. Uh, it's got the uh, Ohio title when it was uh, 2,947 miles. Uh, the little photograph there of uh, when it was featured in Hemmings Magazine. Uh, picture of the keys. All the stuff you see in the trunk will come with the car. We're going to have a picture of the Marty Report, the build sheet, uh, on our website. Uh, but everything you see in the trunk is going to stay there. <clears throat> so people want documented classic cars, documented collector cars. Uh, this car is heavily documented. It's a, Not only is it a beautiful uh, time capsule, but it also has uh, documentation to go with it. Passenger side of the car is just as straight as the uh, driver's side. You know, I can't really emphasize enough what I think of this car. Um, I believe this car will go ultra fast. It's a beautiful color. Um, it's a rare car that you do not see every day. Uh, you know, four-speed car. The interior is immaculate. This car is like, like I just said, time capsule, and it's almost like showroom condition. It's really a fantastic vehicle. Chrome around the... Uh, Vinyl top, once again, um, just awesome. LTD badge isn't cracked up or distorted at all. Uh, window glass clarity on the passenger side is the same as it was on the driver's. Nice quarter window, uh, passenger side door glass, vent window, all that stuff's in real nice shape. Look at how nice those body lines are where the door meets the rear quarter, meets the lower rocker. There are zero paint issues down low. Bubbles, cracks, blisters on the uh, quarters, doors, uh, fenders. Just a really, really nice car. Opening up the passenger side door, same deal. Your courtesy lights illuminate. <clears throat> your sail panel lights illuminate. Uh, LTD badge on the door. Nice wood grain accent. Really gives it a, a classy look. Wood grain around the glove compartment area. This is such a nice car. For those collectors out there, this may be one to add. Um, door fitment to the rear quarter, to the front fender, just uh, fantastic. Your 428 badge on the uh, passenger side fender, just as it was on the driver's side. All your wheel opening moldings are in nice condition. Uh, the American racing wheels that are on it look to be uh, in like new condition. You can take a look at those on our uh, website. <clears throat> no issues on the vinyl top whatsoever, high or low, or around the front windshield, around the rear window, to the drop downs on the rear quarters, on top. <clears throat> Get a close shot of that paint on the top of the fender, on the, on the hood. Just a really nice paint job. <clears throat> great, great car. We're going to take it outside right now. We're going to throw it up in the air and check out the undercarriage. And then shortly after that, we will do a test drive. I haven't driven this car yet, but I'm sure it's going to uh, be a real fun car to drive. Not sure if you're picking up on it in this video or not, but I love this car. And I hope you do too. But, <laughs> you know, if you visit our showroom, you might not agree with me. I do encourage you guys to visit our showroom. We have a beautiful facility. We have uh, 70 cars on hand, and probably 55 to 60 of them are here in the building. Um, if you're interested in this 1968 Ford, we will be glad to pull it outside for you. You can look at that awesome blue paint and sunshine. We'll throw it up in the air for you and check out the undercarriages, 40, however many hundred original mile car. Uh, check out the floor pans, the uh, tires, the bottom of the motor, bottom of the transmission, all your suspension components. We'll let you drive the car. You can see how the car performs, how it stops, starts, steers, how the uh, tranny shifts for you, all that stuff. Everything we do in this video, you can do in person. This way, when the car shows up, wherever you might be located at, in the United States or in the world, there's no surprises because you were here and you went over the car for yourself. 
We've been doing sight unseen internet based business for over 20 years. So we sell a lot of units, not only here in our Daytona facility, but also in our PA store that are sight unseen. We make a lot of people happy. A lot of people uh, get to own the car they wanted in high school as a kid or you know, has just wanted since they were younger or owned at one time and want to own again, whatever the circumstance may be. But we are in the business of selling 30, 40, 50 year old cars. They all have flaws, deficiencies, weaknesses. You know, uh, we try to disclose some of those in these video presentations, and we also try to disclose all the positive aspects of the car. And there's quite a few with this 68 Ford. Uh, but nobody's a better judge of how to spend your hard-earned money than you are, so I do encourage you guys to come in person to check out this 1968 Ford LTD or any other vehicle in our inventory you might be interested in. Let's take it outside, throw it up in the air, and check out the undercarriage, and we'll do a test run for you in our four-speed bench seat 1968 Ford LTD. Underneath our 1968 Ford disc brakes up front. You can get a shot of the 428 up front. See the front of the block's nice and dry there, oil pan. Then you got your cross member in the way. And we continue to the uh, rear, which you can't really see much. Freeze plugs look good up there. You can see that. Uh, Flywheel is covered. Frame rails on the car look good. Driver side and passenger side. Cross member supporting the trans up in good shape. Check out the floor pans. All original, all one piece. Such an awesome car. Uh, so you have dual exhaust, or, uh, dual exhaust manifolds, drops down to your duals, H-pipe, and then back to your uh, mufflers. Ford Motor Company, the original factory exhaust. Drum brakes in the rear, of course. Got a big gas tank wedged up there to power this uh, big motor. Frame rails on the car look good. Driver side and passenger side. There's your trunk pan. Awesome car, time to drive it. Before we do that, let's talk about payments. If you are a cash buyer, cashier's check from your bank, bank wire transfer. If you're financing, click the car lenders we work with. We'll do five to 15 year loans on these classic cars. 10% down your minimum, and then uh, the rest over that five to 15 year period, whatever your approval's for. Approval's based on price of the car, credit score, debt to income ratio, time on the job, things like that. Um, if you'd like to put down more, you can, but they're gonna require you put a minimum of 10%. Let's say you get approved for an eight year loan on this car and you wanna pay it off in one. They aren't going to penalize you for doing that. That makes it nice to own one of these collectibles as well. Once the vehicle is funded, we put the car through a pre-delivery inspection. Torque the lug nuts, check the tire pressure, check for leaks, check the lights, all that stuff. Old cars, anything can happen. Anything can start leaking, anything can stop working. Therefore, we put it through one last shakedown and give it the green light prior to its making its way to you. Once uh, it's through the inspection, we go through detail, and then, of course, it's dispatched to a carrier, and it's on its way to you before we are the ones handling the shipping. Typically, we can have a truck here within 48 hours to pick the car up. However, it could be a little longer if you're on the West Coast or in a more difficult destination, and you probably know who you are. But I promise you, once we're funded, we move quickly. And if you're the one handling the shipping, we'll let you know when the car's ready, and you can come pick it up or have your uh, carrier come pick it up. Let's set our 68 LTD down on the ground. I'm uh, excited to show you the interior of this car as well as how it runs, so let's do that now. What a sweet ride. Horn. Wipers. Uh, fuel gauge. Yep, we're on empty. So I'm gonna go put some gas in it. We'll show you that works. Radio. Clock does not work. We don't fix clocks. Um, turn signal, driver's side. 
4560, that is the actual miles on the car, 4,560 miles. Passenger side. You see the dash pad is in fantastic shape. All the wood grain trim around the glove box area. Four speed floor shifter for idling nicely. Got your cranks for your vent windows. Those work. Speedo works. I like this car. This car rides absolutely fantastic. We're going to show you that right now. This car is slick. 35 bucks worth of fuel premium, of course. Brought the gauge up to half a tank. Told you we were on empty. It's a big car, big motor, it takes off. This car rides like you're on air. Look at how nice. No vibrations in the car whatsoever. No engine vibration, tranny vibration, tire noise or vibration. Speedo works and it's accurate. Awesome. This is a car. This will be a memorable one. For me, anyways. And whoever gets it is getting a nice piece of American history and a, a nice quality car. Brakes. Car stops like it should, no vibrations, pulsations. So we're going to run it through some gears. I am going to uh, take the RPMs up a little bit because this car does have some uh, acceleration to it. And get up and go, even though it's big and heavy. Am I going to get a, a window here? Yep. All right, here we go. Seventy five in this big beast. What a ride. There's sixty miles an hour, no hands on the wheel. This is a quality automobile. Nineteen sixty eight Ford LTD. Don't hesitate on this one. This will be gone. There was a guy in our showroom yesterday looking at this car, and I said don't wait till the end of the week if you're interested in it, because it won't be here. And he says, I believe it. And, uh, you know, he had to go home and think it over, which is understandable, but who knows? Whoever gets to be the new owner of this vehicle is getting themselves a nice automobile. 386-944-9219 is our contact phone here in Daytona Beach if you're interested in this Ford LTD. Tanksters.com is our website. We're going to see all the photos of this car today, along with this video presentation we're doing for you right now. Look at this thing idle. At full retail price, our 68 LTD includes shipping in the lower 48 United States on an in-close carrier. It also includes a powertrain warranty that covers engine, transmission, and rear end. That warranty is good at any ASC certified facility in the United States. You don't have to bring it back to Florida or to Hankster's Hot Rods or to a Ford dealer. You can probably take it to the same person that's working on your daily driver. Is the price of the car negotiable? It most certainly is. If we negotiate the price of the car, that warranty comes off. Warranty's good at full retail price, no exceptions. Also, the shipping comes off. At our full retail price, we arrange the pickup. We arrange the delivery. We pay the driver. At a negotiated cost, we will put you with a shipping broker if you need assistance shipping. And uh, you can decide whether you want to ship open or enclosed. I would not advise shipping this car open, but if you own it, it's up to you. Oop, my bad. I'm trying to adjust my mirror so I can see here. Um, you can decide open or enclosed, and then you're going to pay the driver when they deliver the car. Of course, if you're local to us here in the Sunshine State, you want to come drive this car home, you can certainly do that. It'd make for an outstanding ride. The car rides really nice. Maybe you're a collector, hobbyist, enthusiast, and you have your own open or enclosed trailer. You want to come trailer at home. 
maybe uh, spend a couple days here in Daytona. There's a lot of fun stuff to do. You can do that as well. Hangsters Hot Rods is located in sunny Daytona Beach, and our website is hangsters.com. This is a beautiful car, a really, really fantastic uh, uh, vehicle. I advise you call, email, text, whatever your preferred method of contact is. Get a hold of us. We will uh, get back to you as soon as we possibly can and uh, snatch up this 1968 LTD before it's gone. Hangsters.com, check us out.